We stopped in Sutton, West Virginia. We saw a sign for the uh, Welcome Center and the Monster Museum. So we're going to head inside and take a look. But just before we go inside, check out the front of that building right there. That's just the facade left of an old building. And uh, well, let's go. Well, here's the Flatwoods Monster Museum and uh, we're gonna go in inside and take a look. Ooh. They even welcome dogs it said. Okay, we are in the Mothman Museum. It's an old soda fountain by the way. And there's the old soda fountain left. So on September 12th 1952 there was a group of five boys playing on a mountaintop in Flatwoods West Virginia in between like Flatwoods and Peters, they saw a streak of light across the, across the sky around dusk and they called for their mom and they, the five boys and their mom and, I forgot to tell you this part, and a National Guardsman was actually with them too. All went up on the hill to investigate what they thought was a plane crash and when they got, as they were like going up the hill, they started to smell sulfur and they started coughing and when they got to the top of the hill, they saw what they now call the Flatwoods Monster. It was about 10 feet tall, 8 to 10 feet tall they described it, um, with like a stiff metal dress thing on it. And they all like fled back to town. It was reported in a newspaper. Some government officials came in and investigated the area. Uh, there were other sightings that weren't as widely talked about, but this sighting was the one that was kind of the kickoff to everything and um, was most widely reported in newspapers. A lot of some reports say some of the kids had like respiratory issues after the fact and were treated in the surrounding hospitals near the county. Okay, well thank you. You're welcome. It's a very interesting story. Yeah, very interesting. And this is the Welcome Center. It was an old drugstore with a soda fountain. And it still has a lot of the cabinets and the drawers where things were stored. And now it's a home for monsters replicas kind of reminds me of a doctor who like a like a uh, oh what do they call those guys the uh, dating no it's a, it's a monster and doctor who Okay, so I remember what I was trying to think. It's like a, a Dalek from Doctor Who. But, um, just those pictures of it remind me of a Dalek. Metal skirt. And it is a visitor center, so they have a lot of brochures here for local things to do in the state. Some t-shirts for sale. And here's a version of the, the moth, I mean the uh, the monster would look like. 